so we are just sitting here in the little park for we are just waiting for Airbnb to get ready so we can check in. We have all of these bags with us. <laughs> so yeah. But yeah, then we just ate some lunch and it was really really good. Um yeah we woke up at like 3 3 a.m. to catch our flight here to Porto so yeah we're a bit tired but uh, yeah hotel um yeah we've been walking around in Porto for like three and a half hours after we ate we ate some lunch and um yeah and we then yeah walked around the city with <laughs> both our suitcases um yeah yeah now we're here and um we've just been down at a supermarket and getting some groceries um yeah i think we'll make some food here tonight um we're both quite tired um from all of this traveling today so yeah but uh, i'll show you around in our little apartment here is the door and Closet thing. Just have my suitcase there. Uh, and there is the bathroom. He was just having a shower. Then we got like a little sofa thing and <laughs> ignore all the mess we just made. <laughs> but yeah, here's the bed. And then TV. Then we have a little table here where we can sit and eat. Um, and here we got the kitchen. We can make some food. This is the view. Not the best, but it's what it is. But yeah, I think this apartment hotel is quite nice. It's, it, yeah. It just seems very nice and yeah. But I think we'll make some food and have an early early night. <laughs> um yeah, and then we will explore more of Porto tomorrow. Good morning everybody. We are headed out to a bookstore called I'll put it in the screen. I don't know how to pronounce it, but we're headed out to the bookstore. We got some early morning tickets. Oh. Uh, yeah. really really pretty bookstore um very inspired by or like it was very Harry Potter-ish even though JK Rowling said she was not inspired from that bookstore but yeah it was really really pretty and for Harry Potter lovers like us it was really cool to see um but yeah we're gonna make some lunch now
So we are out exploring them. Okay, ate some lunch and uh, yeah, now we are down at the waterfront area. There's so many hills in Porto. So yeah. Hey, can you see this? This is the train track and it's just going right down. <laughs> it looks like a road coaster. Wine history, I think. So it's gonna be really fun. And there is also a little tasting at the end. about the wine and its history and how to make it. <laughs> what grape were you? Chardonnay. Ooh. Maybe what's a Chardonnay and now this a yeah. Uh, 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 yeah. day um just had something to eat now we're about to head out Let's see if i can place you here Bye. great <laughs> yeah we were at um, the world of wine uh, experience yesterday um it was actually quite interesting i think um, I'm not usually a 
museum kind of person um, but I found this really really interesting and I really enjoyed it um, we had a little wine tasting at the end um, and it was really fun to like taste the wine and like do all these little small tricks she had and yeah it was really really cool and uh, yeah and then afterwards we we headed to a place where we could see the sunset um, and we got there like 45 minutes before the sunset and it was so busy like there was so many people it was ridiculous um, but we got a good spot and uh, watched the sunset and yeah it was really nice um, yeah then we just got home and went to bed um, but yeah, now we are heading out to explore again, so yeah, we'll take you along. like heard it so much we were like okay we're going back to the apartment to relax um yeah and then we just made some food and had a really relaxing evening um yeah and now i'm just getting ready and then we're gonna eat some breakfast and just pack the last things, um, yeah, and then we will head to Lisbon. 